I'll do. Time for another beer review, and for this one, we're off to Dea for saturated in citra. So it's got the usual crock on the front there. Being, I've got to say something about Dea because pre-lockdown, I mean, I, I've only really started doing this channel in lockdown, and it was something to do because I'm bored in lockdown, really. And hopefully, I'll carry on doing it after lockdown because I really do enjoy it, but. I've never had much daya. I'd only had about two beers of theirs. And while I've been in lockdown and I've been buying from different places, I've been sourcing a lot of daya beers. And I've had about six or seven while I've been in lockdown alone. And um, they've all been amazing. So um, one thing that I have learned from lockdown is drink more daya beer. And um, so, um, yes. So I'll get this out of the glass see what we get. So this is um, a single hop citra double IPA, 500 mil cam, uh, 8%. So um, just says to keep it f fresh, keep it in the fridge, hops fade fast, all that. Um, but yeah, and the customer service, any d the dealers I've had, they've been really, really fast. And um, I can't fault them. Um, so... Definitely, definitely uh, get yourself a few day beers. So, beer in a glass, that's uh, an absolute um, shite paw. But uh, I've got a two finger of a white head. That is, that's that's as murky as they come. Um, murky orange, just get the nose. It smells dank, but I've got like a there's a mango in there and an orange but yeah it looks amazing on the eye that like right it's diving cheers everybody oh that's amazing that is absolutely perfect IPA that is just brilliant Oh, it's so thick. Really thick, juicy. Oh, it's brilliant. Um, it's kind of like orange and mango with a slight bitterness on the finish. If I was picking the two fruits out, like it's really just, it's just like tropical. All the tropical fruits, but it's orange and mango is probably like the two that are coming out the most for me. Oh, it's so juicy. And like I say, really, really thick. The body of this beer is unbelievable. Um, it just made, and it's just so easy drinking. 8%, you wouldn't know. Um, you could easily tan a few of these and then be on your backside. The body's made. It's the body. It's the body that makes this drink. Yeah, it's like orange mango. There's a slight lime in the aftertaste, but oh, I can't. I can't. I can't. I can barely fault it. That is beautiful. Another great day of beer in lockdown. Well done, day. Um, you've uh, you've made a fan of me in this period. Um, so yeah and it's Thursday so tomorrow there'll be some more ones going on the website so no doubt I'll be buying them and no doubt they'll be getting put on the channel in the next week so definitely definitely you all know who they are they, they probably are um, right now my favourite brewery in the UK that's um, how much I love them at the minute but yeah keep up the good work there so yeah um just giving you a bit of it while I'm here. A few things I've got planned for the channel. So, um, on a Monday, I'm still going to do my Cumbrian beers. Um, on a Friday, I'm up for um, recommendations. And every week, I'm going to do a different beer that's been recommended. So, put in comments anything you want me to try on any of my beers. Any, any of my reviews, just fire it in the comments. 
and I'll um, whatever I get the most of in that week, plus on my private facebook page or on my instagram page i've got an instagram page for the channel as well now so just um fire it in there whatever gets the most votes likes etc that's what i'll have so tomorrow um i've got my first recommendation challenge that'll be happening and then going forward as well on a sunday i'm gonna do one from the U my european shops as well so that's my plan Monday, Cumbrian beers. Fridays, there'll be a challenge beer. And Sundays, there'll be a European shop beer. And hopefully I'll do all my reviews, mainly on the weekend. So I'll have enough content so you'll get a video every day if you can be bothered. But that's the plan going forward. So thank you for watching again. Keep watching, like, subscribe and all that. I don't say it enough, but I genuinely am grateful for everybody that does take the time to watch my videos. Um, it does mean a lot to me. And to all the VTubers out there who engage with me and tolerate me, thank you again. And um, on to the next one.